Human Body System, the Digestive System, Quarter 2, Lesson 1, Week 2, Day 1. Lesson Language, name the organs where the food you eat passes through. Take a look at this picture and identify the parts of the digestive system. We have the mouth, esophagus, stomach, small intestine, large intestine, anus or rectum. Activity 1.1. Read the story and answer the questions. The Amazing Food Adventure. One sunny afternoon, a little piece of bread named Reddy decided to go on a big adventure through the human body. Reddy was excited because he was about to help the body get energy and nutrients. He was curious about what happens to food after it's eaten. Reddy's journey began in the mouth, where the teeth chewed him into smaller pieces. And a special helper called saliva started breaking him down. Wow, this is the first step of digestion, Reddy thought. Next, Reddy found himself sliding down a long tube called the esophagus. It felt like a slippery slide. He was gently pushed down until he landed in a big, hollow, and muscular bag called the stomach. Here, stomach juices mixed and mashed Reddy even more. He felt a bit dizzy but knew it was necessary. These juices are breaking it down even more so the body can get the nutrients, he exclaimed. After a while, Reddy moved into a long, twisty tube called the small intestine. Here, Reddy was joined by his friends, the liver, the pancreas, and the gallbladder. Each friend had a special job to do. The liver added a substance called bile to help Reddy break down fats. The pancreas squirted juices to help digest him. And the gallbladder stored extra bile in case it was needed later. This is where most of the nutrients get absorbed. Reddy realized as he, as he felt his tiny bits traveling into the blood vessels. The body needs these nutrients for energy, growth, and repair. After the small intestine, Reddy wasn't quite done yet. He moved into the large intestine. This place was wider and shorter. What happens here? Reddy wondered. Here? The body absorbs any extra water, a friendly bacteria explained. After that, what's left becomes solid waste. Finally, Brady ended his journey at the anus, where the solid waste was pushed out of the body. Goodbye, Brady shouted. I've helped give the body energy and got rid of the waste. Questions what is the starting point of the digestive system as mentioned in the story? The correct answer is the mouth. Brady's journey began in the mouth, where the teeth chewed him into smaller pieces and a special helper called saliva started breaking him down. This is the first step of digestion. The mouth is the starting point of the digestive system. It is responsible for the mechanical and chemical digestion of food. Question number two. It's further break down the food with the help of acid and enzymes. What is it? What part of the digestive system? The stomach. In the stomach, Brady was mixed and mashed by stomach juices, which helped break him down into smaller pieces so the body could get the nutrients from him. The function of the stomach is 
to further break down the food mechanically and chemically using acid and enzymes to convert it into a semi-liquid mixture called chyme. Number three, it is where most of the digestion and absorption of nutrients occur. What part of the digestive system? The correct answer is the small intestine. Bread moved into a long twisted tube called the small intestine. The small intestine is where most of the digestion and absorption of nutrients occur. Number four, what part will most of the absorption of water and electrolytes as well as helps in the elimination of the waste from the body occurs? What part of the digestive system? The correct answer is the large intestine. Brady was then taken to this place where it was wider and shorter, the large intestine. Here it is absorbed, it absorbs water and electrolytes from undigested food, forming feces, and helps in the elimination of waste from the body. 5. What are the main functions of the parts of the digestive system? The correct answer is, the correct answer, answers are ingestion, mechanical digestion, chemical digestion, absorption, transportation, and excretion. Function of the digestive system. Ingestion. It is the process of taking in food or drink through the mouth. Mechanical digestion is the physical breakdown of food into smaller pieces through chewing, grinding, and churning. Chemical digestion. It is the breakdown of food into smaller molecules through the action of enzymes and other substances. Absorption. It is the process of absorbing nutrients, water, and other substances from the digested food into the bloodstream. Transportation. It is the movement of food along the digestive tract from the mouth to the anus. Excretion. It is the elimination of waste products such as undigested food, uh, undigested food material, and other waste materials from the body. Activity 1.2. The digestive system. Draw, label the parts, and describe the function of each part of the digestive system. Complete the table by filling in the function of the digestive system. Identify the parts of the digestive system. Number one, it is a muscular tube that transports food from the mouth to the stomach. Number two, it is the starting point of the digestive system. Number three, it is where most of the digestion and absorption of nutrients occur. Number four, this organ absorbs water and electrolytes from undigested food forming feces and helps in the elimination of waste from the body. Number five, it further breaks down the food mechanically and chemically using acid and enzymes to convert it into a semi-liquid mixture called chyme. 